All right, let's give it a try. Let's see. Press once. Hey, look at that. That worked. And so I'm upstairs now in my bedroom where I'm going to plug up my uh, Chromecast with Google TV. This video here is going to be the setup. So I'm going to show you exactly how you connect the device to your wireless and uh, do that whole jazz from your phone here. So uh, let's get into it. All right, so I've got everything uh, upstairs now. My HDTV, where I'll be plugging this in at. That's, um, let's get everything hooked up now. Fairly uh, straightforward. Cable plugs into brick, and then cable plugs into Chromecast, and then uh, Chromecast plugs into your HDMI port. How does this thing always get stuck? Now, of course, uh, my HDMI ports are on the opposite side from where the uh, port is to plug everything in, but we're going to plug this into HDMI 2 right here. Bingo. And then we'll just run our cable over to the other side. And then we're going to say out with the old. This goes to the Chromecast 4K that's up here. And uh, in with the new. Bingo. Now it's plugged in. Got a little power light there. And uh, of course, a nice Google G on my TV now. Perfect. Ooh. I like the animation. I like the animation. I gotta go get my phone though, so I can show you exactly how you set this up. But I'm wanting to see some of this stuff. Oh no! I didn't put the batteries in. I gotta do that. I'm really curious if these were like painted the same color for a reason. I mean, look at that. That's the exact same color. So it told me to start a pairing on the uh, controller. Let me get this put up. Look at that. They both go the same way. I've never seen a device do that. Nope. I didn't even have to pair it. It just, as soon as the batteries got in it, it, it knew this was the, uh, it knew this was the remote. Sweet. So English. And um, now set up with the Google Home app. So download and open your home app and scan the code. Got it. I like this little disclaimer they have here. Set up on TV instead may take longer. Requires typing with remote. All right. Let's get into our Google Home app. And uh, right here at the top, I have a set up Chromecast button. I choose my home, but not show you that. And now it's looking for devices. Bam, scan the code. Bada bing. And now we're connecting to the Chromecast. Connect. And now look, they're, they're both like dancing in sync. Follow the instructions in the Google Home app. Okay. I'm, I'm waiting on those now. By the way, for anybody that may have noticed uh, this photo of this guy, this is my girlfriend's, this is mine. But as you can see, they're both on June. We forget about them because, well, they're behind the door. All right. Hey, Big C, blah, 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 privacy, yep, whatever. Uh-huh, yeah, I agree. Where is my device located? Master bedroom. Next. Um... Yeah, I guess we'll call it the Master Bedroom TV 2 because, well, the other one's already called that. I'll have to rename that later. Next. Wi-Fi connection. That one. Yep. And connecting to Wi-Fi. I like that they're, like, in sync. Look at that. They're literally on the same thing. That's, that's cool. Home app wants to use temporary Wi-Fi network to connect to Well, you already asked me that. Connecting to device. This says connected. Could not communicate with tr Chromecast. All right. All right. Let's try. Let's try this again. Hopefully, uh, you guys won't won't have this this problem here. Which now that I can see my phone's on wireless, I noticed a minute ago it was on LTE. So that may have been what messed it up. But I didn't have my Wi-Fi off. I don't know. Now it says connected. Sign in with your Google account. Signing in the Chromecast with your Google account. Nice. And it's still got the matching 
It's you. Next. Oh, it wants me to use my face unlock. Confirm. There we go. And now it even wants my password. I think we are finally signed in. And there we go. Downloading system update. Chromecast will restart soon. Then in here it's got me some stuff. So use location. I always allow that. I don't care to try to improve their stuff. Recommendations. Yada yada. Except Google Assistant, find shows and more. Search across all your TV apps, nice, allow. Oh, and now it's probably gonna try and find all of my TV apps. And uh, here we're installing the system update for the Android TV, or for the Chromecast with Android TV that literally just came out. You can even do voice match with this, very, very nice. I don't know if I care for that, but why not? Well, that was easy. All right, select my services. We have Netflix, we have Disney Plus, we have Prime Video, and that should do it. Oh, look at that. It can do slideshows. Sure. Stay in the know. I'm already in the know. All done. Here's a review Master Bedroom TV 2. That's my devices. Continue. This should probably just bring me back. Yeah, setup is finished. Complete setup on TV screen with remote. All right, done. Sweet. So we can continue that setup on the TV with the remote once this update's done, which it's like halfway done now. I really, really dig the startup animation. All right. That glare from this light in my TV. Jesus. Re-establishing your network connection. Connected. All right, it looks like uh, we're ready to grab the remote and see what all we can do with this puppy. I'll say the first setup takes a minute, but it's got updates and all kinds of stuff to do. Control your volume and power with your Chromecast remote. If you want to use your phone, what's... Holy crap, really? TV... I got a Samsung. You'll hear music next. If you can't hear it, make sure the volume's turned up. Point the Chromecast remote at your TV and toggle the up volume. Trying another code. So I was able to just say no, and now it's trying another code to set it up on my TV. That's pretty sweet. We're on code uh, four of five. Sadly, none of these have changed the volume on my TV. No. Five of five. No. It looks like the Chromecast remote can't control your volume. Of course not. That's just this TV, though. Uh, trust me, I've had this happen with, like, a lot of devices in this weird 3D TV. All right, let's see. Press once. The TV should turn off. Wait eight seconds. Press again. All right, let's give it a try. Let's see. Press once. Hey, look at that. That worked. Just the volume doesn't work. Now let's wait the eight seconds. Pretty certain it's been eight seconds. Power on. Look at that. That's pretty sweet. Did the power buttons work? Yes. Yes, they did. All right, power control's ready. All right, sweet. Now it's installing apps. This does take a little bit of time to set up. All right, so now it says your Chromecast with Google TV is ready. Start exploring. Oh, look at this. So this is all the stuff for me. Whoa, what just happened? It's still working out some kinks, I think. All right, so that will do it for the Chromecast with Android TV setup. That was everything from plugging it in to the steps that you'll go through on your phone to connect it to your wireless and everything else. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Click the like button, click subscribe down below, and I will see you in the next one. Deuces. I want to be a pizza box. Recycle me. Nice one, Best Buy.